Hello friends, in this video we shall see what are the different types of projects that you can build using the NetBeans IDE. So creating different projects. As I have told in the very beginning, NetBeans IDE is a very comprehensive and multi-purpose IDE in the sense that it supports different languages as well as different types of Java projects. For instance, the standard Java project which is based upon the Java SE or the Java standard edition, the console based application or a GUI based application can be created using NetBeans, I will call it as a Java standard project, Java project. As a replacement to the Swing library, Java has introduced a Java FX, which is also a collection of different graphics elements, which can create very rich, you know, uh, collection of different uh, GUI elements, which are substitute for the Swing elements. So, using this FX, Java FX library also, you can create very rich desktop GUI based application. So, that can be the second category. Java web applications which are to be hosted on certain Java enabled servers like Glassfish or Tomcat or any other Java enabled servers on the top of which if you want to install or deploy certain web based applications that you can create, it will be the third category Java web applications. Java enterprise edition softwares. Enterprise edition software or enterprise software is supposed to be catering to the needs of large enterprises where there are three different elements of the software, the front end, the middleware and the back end. So such like enterprise edition software is to be used with the support of Java EE edition of the JDK. So Java EE softwares which will typically include certain Java beans or different entities that will be a part of the Java EE software will be you know included in the Java EE type of project. Micro edition, Java has a special JDK called as Java ME which supports the development of mobile applications. So that mobile application development can also be one of the project category. Java supports the application development on a HTML5 and JavaScript platform. So you can create a web based application using HTML5 and JavaScript. As I said, Java supports different languages in addition to Java. PHP is one of the languages that can be used as a basis for creating an application. So PHP application you can build using NetBeans. So for that you have to first enable your IDE for PHP, provide the you know uh, installation path of the PHP interpreter and do certain additional configuration settings that I have showed you in earlier video. Having done that you can use a or you can create rather a PHP application. So it can be one of the additional project categories. C and C++ these languages can also be used as a basis for a project using the NetBeans. So that of course you have to activate or enable using the configuration settings. While doing that you have to give the locations of the compilers of C or C++ you can also even use the Fortran language for project development. So that type of configuration settings you have to incorporate uh, then you can use C, C++ language project also. And the Maven projects, as I told in the beginning NetBeans basically uses the ant build tool for building the Java applications in NetBeans, but if you want to change the you know preference and choose the Maven 
as the build automation tool. You can choose it and then you can start uh, by choosing in the first display itself the Maven as the basis of building auto, uh, build, build automation. Then you can create a Maven based project also. So these are the different categories on which you can build a Java, Java or PHP or C, C++ project. So if you start NetBeans and you click a new project from the file menu, we give you the options. These are the filters. Choose any of them and start the building or development process. What we shall do? We can select some categories of these. I will start by creating a Java standard edition software which will run in the console mode, simple input output on the console or in the output window itself. We will perform certain out input output activities. We will also build a Java GUI application wherein the swing elements will be used. We will use a Java web application. I will also show you how to build a Java EE application in NetBeans. These are the types of Java projects using NetBeans I will show you with the help of a demonstration. Then we will also build a PHP project using NetBeans. All these examples one by one I will demonstrate in front of you so that you will be able to understand how NetBeans is a very productive tool for rapid application development as, as the uh, NetBeans features list says that it is a rapid rapid application development tool. So how rapidly you can do that, that we shall see with the help of the practical demonstrations. Each for Java standard edition project, Java GUI project, I will also show you how to build the Java library, Java class library and then the other examples also I will show you one by one.